will learn now the effect of change of pressure on a, on a gas. So in this picture we have molecules of a gas and because it's gas the molecules of the distance between them is very large and to this gas a pressure is applied. See there's a piston here and you apply a pressure. When you apply a pressure the molecules of gas now come closer to each other and now from a solid here from a gas here this is a gas this is a gas is now getting changed into a liquid and when the liquid is further subjected to pressure like in this see the piston you press it the molecules come even closer to each other and from the liquid now you get a solid so what is the effect of pressure on a gas the gas when subjected to pressure changes to liquid and the liquid then changes to solid because the particles begin to get closer and closer to each other here is a picture below of how gases can be liquefied to liquefy gases here we have gases this is a gas with molecules far apart two things are done number one you apply a pressure and you also lower the temperature see you cool it and you also compress it here you compress it so two things you compress you increase the pressure and you cool it and then the the gas particles come closer and then even closer here they're coming see closer then even closer here and the gas is turned into a liquid so to liquefy gases we need to do two things we need to number one apply pressure and number two we need to reduce temperature when we do both these things the gas gets converted into liquid that is called liquefy the gas now we'll summarize whatever we have learned the change of state in this picture so here we had a solid there was a solid here and this solid on heating give us a liquid that process was called fusion the liquid on heating gave us a gas and that was called vaporization however if the solid directly was heated and gave us a gas it was called sublimation now if the gas here we have the gas now if the gas was cooled down we got a liquid which was called condensation and the liquid was cooled down you got a solid which was called solidification in some substances when a gas is cooled down it directly gives a solid and that is called sublimation so you need to learn this chart how solids can be changed to liquids, liquids can be changed to gas, sometimes solids can be directly changed to gases and gases on cooling can be directly changed to solids.